All right, guys, heading to the mall right now. I've got to return a few things. Um, and then I got to, I got to get an oil change. Time for an oil change. Uh, drop it. For some reason, well, I like to go to a certain place, but it takes forever. So it usually takes like an hour. But so I gotta go kill some time. So I may head over to Starbucks. I got a little gift card. I may use a, uh, my gift card at Starbucks. Maybe uh, do, do a hangout. I might be one of those guys who hangs out at Starbucks like on their phone or laptop and like pretends to be like super important. I think I'm gonna do that today. Uh, I'll work on uh, some articles for the website. Um, and then something I just realized too. I've had my car since 2009, and I've never changed my windshield wipers. Like, I know that's not good. Uh, they can still kind of work, though. So it's like, I bet you if I swapped them out, I'd get a nice crisp wipe. Instead, I'd get, like, more of a smudge. But I'm just like, eh, 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 I don't want to mess with them. I'll just leave them as they are. Uh, but, hey, I was on my way to work uh, yesterday, and there were protesters in the middle of the highway, uh, like going into Boston, so it caused like the, pretty much the entire city to shut down because no one get in the city. It was causing extreme traffic. Like it took me, I was couldn't get anywhere, and I wasn't even going into the city. I was like, "What the hell's going on?" These people put themselves in barrels. They put like their arms in barrels and poured concrete on the barrels. They had diapers on in case they shit themselves because they're absolute idiots. Like, I understand protesting and for the cause, I'm all for that. But, like, if you're going to do it by sitting in the middle of a fucking highway, get a goddamn grip, you psychopath. I just want to speak my mind on that matter. Um, and I'm not even mad that it affected me. I'm just like, it, like, there was, there was, the, they caused harm to other people because there was ambulances that, like, uh, needed to get through. Like, someone had a, there was in, like, a car accident, uh, like, a couple hours, uh, before they started protesting and um, they needed to be rushed to a hospital in Boston and the ambulances couldn't get through because they were in the middle of the road and you have someone with a serious spinal cord issue they had to do like a detour to another hospital that wasn't even in the city and they wanted to go to like you know one in Boston it's way better but like you know you're fucking with people's lives when you're I, like I, hey, I'm all for uh, what they were protesting and but by if you're wearing a fucking diaper in the middle of a highway with your arm, some pour, you poured cement into a barrel. These people—they're not even—they didn't even look like—they looked like lunatics. Like protest normally. Don't be a complete jackass. I hate you. All right, I, I had to rant. I just had to because I'm like, what are you doing? You're making it worse. You know what I mean? No one wants to hear your cause if you're gonna sit in the middle of a highway. That's not a like a safe thing. Like, they're lucky they didn't get killed. Like, all they would, all it would have taken is, like, a psycho to run them over or, like, shoot them in the head. I don't know. Uh, I, I don't know if other people heard about this that are, don't live in Boston or in the city. Um, if you live around this area, you probably heard of it and you saw what they looked like. They looked like complete slobs. So, I don't know. Uh, like I said, I'm, I'm all for why they were protesting for the Black Lives Matter and, and the cause. I've... You know, I, I say go ahead, protest away, but do it in like a respectable manner. Don't if you if you have to put on a diaper to protest, you're a complete moron. All right, guys, inside finish line right now, checking out some of these Air Max ones. This is the new Air Max ones. They're super super light. I think this colorway is sick. That white part is 3M too. I'm in love with these. I might try to find these if I can get them for under retail. Got on the New Balance 710 Fresh Supply Company uh, collab. Checking out some of these some of these deals right now. Air Max, Lunar, Flying at Chaka, the free. Only like a hundred bucks, not bad. I like those. So there was a two hour wait uh, for an oil chain. Two hours, that's absurd. Uh, so the, uh, I don't know, I, I could check Valvoline, but anytime I used to go to Valvoline, I used to go with my Jeep though. It was way more expensive. This place is like 20, 22 bucks or something, 20 bucks. Valvoline was always like 40 something, but maybe that's because I had a Jeep. Um, maybe I'll pop in there just to get a get a little price. Because usually Valvoline's quick. You, it's like 10 minutes, you just you get to stay in your car. Uh, I'm gonna go grab Starbucks and relax for a minute. Starbucks bathroom reveal. I like it, I like it a lot. It's this nice little lamp shade, little flipper of light. It's cozy in here too, look at all the space. 
It's nice. I haven't done a bathroom review in a while. I like this one. I like the, the setting, the mood. Nice, nice tiles, clean. Look how clean it is. I'm a big fan. I mean, it's, it's not like special by any means, but it's, I mean, it's cozy. You give it a, give it a, a strong seven. Strong seven out of 10. <laughs> Unboxing. This one coming in from Champ Sports, as you can see, extremely large box. So let's go ahead and crack these open. All right, guys. Uh, I just got a pair of sneakers in from Champs. I just filmed the unboxing. Uh, I'll put that on my sneaker channel. And then um, I'm got. I'm on my third coffee today. And what's funny is I got a good night's sleep. I'm just like looking for any edge. I slept great last night but I've got a now I switched over to a black tooth blend I had my Starbucks and I had hot coffee in the morning so anything that can give me a competitive edge hmm. yeah, it's probably like some cleaning supplies they accidentally dropped in there it tastes a little funny today but uh, I'm on my gym I'm on my gym I'm on my way to the gym now I'm gonna do a uh, little what am I doing what am I doing what am I doing oh I'm gonna do shoulders today may hop in the pool get ready for the Pat Sunday Colts bring it on I'm not taking them lightly I'm not taking them lightly a lot of people around here ch chatting thinking it's gonna be an easy game I'm not gonna take them lightly not gonna it's a big game. I think we're so relieved after that Ravens game, but I, I'm not taking them lightly, bro. No. Nope. I've actually really achieved jet fuel status. Pretty good. And actually, once I mix that Splend in, I'm going to be up all night. Your life is significantly better when you're eating five guys. That's just a fact. Time to indulge. I've had three coffees today. <laughs> I feel wired. It's not good because I have to go to bed in an hour and I've got to work tomorrow. But don't drink three coffees in a day and then like expect to be like, hey, I'm tired. No, I'm not. I'm wide awake. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I'm wired. Three coffees. Like th drinking three coffees in a day makes... I, like I'm tweeting random things. It, it, you'd think I'm drunk. I'm not. I'm wired on coffee. And what's funny is I went to the gym. I was there for a while, and I was like, "Oh, I'm gonna get an awesome workout. I'm gonna get a great lift in. I'm gonna get this jet fuel in. I'm gonna." And all of a sudden, I played. I played basketball, so it kind of messed it up. My messed up my lift, but basketball was fun. I played basketball for an hour and a half, lifted for about an hour and a half. So overall, I got a good workout. But I'm, I just don't feel tired. I feel like if I had worked out a little more, I would have been able to burn off more energy. Hmm, maybe I'll go do some push-ups and try to burn the rest of this off. All right, hey, I'm going to bed. Um, I might do a, a live sneaker chat tomorrow. If anyone's been following me for a while, you know that uh, I used to do some epic live sneaker chats. So head over to my sneaker channel tomorrow night, and you might catch a UA live sneaker chat. All right, I'm going to bed now. Bye. <laughs>